Hello guys, welcome to my this video and in this angular tutorial, I will show you how you can make a custom cap. So guys, here you can see the preview. First of all, I will show you what I want to make in this video. So here you can see the cap. So first of all, when I will load it, so here you can see it's the uh, select yellow color, our mission and here is the content of our mission. So I use the lorem ipsum uh, content, just heading I have changed for uh, explaining that when I will change the tab. So here you can see uh, the heading and this is the dummy text I used for in lorem ipsum. So here you can see it's changing. So here if I click the value tab so you can see it's changed so here I, I have written the custom code and I will show you how you can do that and I will write the, all the code custom not I will not use any uh, NPM plugin or anything so guys I hope you will be enjoyed this video and so don't forget to like this video if you find it's a helpful so guys let's I will start this video so first of all I will open my visual studio code editor so guys here you can see I have opened a component HTML file a component CS and a component TS so guys inside this HTML file you can see I have already created an HTML code here so guys here you can see I have written the HTML code that is deep class tab and here I have written the UL UL is first of all our mission our vision and value so uh, now the content content first con content is for mission so here you can see and if I will minimize this and the second content is for value so I will minimize it and the third content sorry second content is for uh, vision and the third content is for value so guys if you want to uh, write this HTML code and the CSS code so you can pause the video and here you can write this code in your project here I'll just I will show you the functionality because the functionality is the main thing okay so HTML I know you can do it by yourself and if you uh, if you want to show uh, the HTML code also so you can write and comment I will make another video that is I will show how you can write this HTML code otherwise you can pause this video and you can uh, you can write this code in your project here you can see just I will scroll this HTML page here, here. so you can write this code from uh, here and here is the CSS CSS uh, code here you can see just I'm scrolling very slowly so you can pause and you can write this HTML and CSS code okay so now guys just I will write the functionality so guys here you can see all the heading I mean if I uh, show here that is this one okay so now it's showing everything so all the a uh, all the li tag so these are the li tag our mission our vision and values so these are the this li tag okay and these are the content for each li tag okay you can see here i mean here this one so our mission this content our vision this content and values for this content very simple html code here you can see already and here is the css code is very simple you can see so now i will start to write the functionality so the functionality main thing i will write here you can see i have written id this is the main thing okay id is for unique every li tags you can see first li tag is for mission so id i have written mission and second li tag is for our vision so i have written the id is vision and the third li tag is values you can see here so the id name you can write anything as per your choice okay and now guys when i will click this li tag so that time just i will change this tab value i mean content so now here i will write the click method so click and here i have to be write the method name so method name you can write as per your choice but method you have to be write click here because when I will click all the tabs, so that time the value will be changed as per click the tab. Okay. So now guys, here you have to write the click, but method name you can write as per your choice. So here I will write the method name is change. Okay. And parenthesis. And now guys, main thing, every method, just I will pass the ID value. So you can pass this ID here. So if you, if I pass the ID here, so that time when I will click this li tag, I mean this li tag, so that time I will get this id value but directly i will not pass the id just i will pass the id value like this way so here i will write single inverted comma and mission because uh, first of all i have used double inverted comma so inside this double inverted comma i cannot write double inverted comma again so i will write single inverted comma and mission i mean this one okay so and the same way here i will write the click method again click and the method name i will write same tap change parenthesis and inside this method i will pass this id value so that means when i will click any each other tab so that time i will get the unique id i will show you that also so here i will do the same thing here just i will change the id value in here okay and now i will copy this tab 
and here just I will move this CSS file here because I don't need this, this CSS file just I will open the TS file okay here you can see so this below the ng on in it just here I will paste this method tap change and inside this tap change method you can see I have passed a parameter that is mission vision value I mean parameter is this ID okay so now for this parameter for denoting this parameter here I have to be passed the parameter that is IDA so this name you can write anything whatever you will write here so that will be denotes this parameter okay so now guys if I write console dot so guys now here if I write console dot lock and inside this console dot lock if I pass this ID is this is the parameter pass this ID is and this parameter is denoting all this value so that means when I will click this li tab so that time I will get mission when I will click this li tab so that time I will get vision and when I will click the last one so I will get the value because this parameters value is denoting this one so now I will save and the HTML file I will save also and uh, here it's showing the error I think just check it okay so the error is that is inside this ts file i have written the id but i did not set the type of this id so i will set the type of this id is any but you can write here instead of any you can write string because here i have passed the string value all the string so how you can know the string so whatever we write inside this inverted comma so that's are the string so this mission vision this value I have written inside this inverted comma so that means these are the string okay so now here I have to be set the parameter type so I have written any any means you can pass string number anything but you can separately write here string also because here I have passed the all the string value so, but I have written any okay so now save so you can see error is removed and now guys here I will open the console so here is the console and now just I will increase the size of console then it will be is clear to you so now guys here if I click this our mission so here you can see I'm getting that is mission because when I'm clicking this tap change method that I passed here so that time just which tab I'm clicking so that's value I'm getting here and by this ID parameter so when I'm clicking here so I'm getting mission when if I click here so I'm getting mission if I click here so I'm getting value so now I'm getting all the tab value so now our the uh, next thing is that is here first of all I have to be write a ng if condition because here I have to be hide all the thing I cannot show before all the value okay just I, ha I have to be shown here the our mission content first of all and I have to be highlighted this our mission and when I will click the vision so the mission content I will be high height just vision content will be so and when I will click this value so that time the values content will be shown and all the content will be height from here for that here I have to be right that is ng if condition so ng if and now inside this ng if just here I have to be passed that is this id so here I will light a value okay I mean variable so variable I will light that is id so id is type any okay and here first of all I will light the value is here this one this mission so, so this mission I will pass before that so that means guys uh, so here first I will light the next code so then it will be clear to you so first of all I have passed here I have taken a variable id and inside this id variable I have passed mission mission that means guys before but because I want to show the uh, our mission content by default okay so that's why I have passed here mission and when I will write the next line of code so in, it, it will be more um, it will be more clear to you okay so now here I will write ng if condition inside this mission so when uh, uh, this condition so when this id this id variable triple equals to will be mission so that means when I will click this tab and inside this ID ID variable I have passed here so when uh, inside this ID variable it will be mission so that time that also passed here so that time it will be shown this content I hope you have understand if you I, this is the confusing thing so if you are confusing here so you can write in comment 
I will just try to explain it in comment section also in your reply. And guys, same thing. This NGF condition here, when this content will be shown, that is when the this ID, I mean this ID variable, whatever past I here, this variable name you can write anything. So guys, this ID variable, this one, when it will be similar to vision so the same thing again here i will copy this one and just here i will paste this one this content is for value okay so here you can see so now here this ng if ng if use for height and so so in the javascript and jquery we write uh, style dot display block display none in jquery we write dot hide method dot show method but here in this angular if you know the basic of angular so you it you, you will be know that that is uh, we write ng if condition for height and so so here i have written ng if and inside this ng if just i have written a condition when it will this content will be so or height that is when when it will this content will be shown when the id id means this variable so when the id will be similar to mission okay and the same way when this content will be so that is when the id that i have passed when this id will be similar to vision because this content is for vision here you can see the heading vision and this content is for value so when this id will be similar to value value means this one i have passed the id here so when this uh, id will be vision so that time this content will be shown okay so now guys it's a done and now here if i uh, refresh i mean forgot uh, first of all i have to be save this thing and i have to be save this uh, one also so now here you can see it's showing by default mission because here i have written the condition that is now it will be more clear to you because i have written the i will just minimize all the content for vision our vision and our values okay just i will open this mission content so first of all you have to be understand what is uh, what i'm doing here that is i have written a condition that is when this id id means this variable okay so when this id will be similar to mission okay so that time this content will be open so guys here by default this id i have set that is mission so that means by default this id is mission it's already it's uh, i am assigning this id is mission because here you can see by default i have assigned mission value is mission so that's why by default is open but if i click this our vision our values it's not working because guys i did not set the vision and here i will change that is value it will be uh, sorry i will copy this one and it will be value okay so i did not set the vision and value by default i set mission here so that's why it's opening again if i set by default vision so uh, you can uh, see here it will be open by default vision okay so here you can see it's open by default vision and here i will save so now you can see by default it's open vision because here i by default set this id value is vision so that means it's coming this condition that is id is vision okay so that's why by default it's open vision so but i i want to open the first content mission so i will set the by default is mission i mean this one okay this one and now guys the main thing when i will click all the tabs so that time it will be changed so when i printed this ids this ids means this one this mission vision and value and inside this method i have passed this id value you can see i already explained that is so that means when i'm i was clicking all the li tab so i was getting the each id okay so now guys here i have to be do one thing that is this dot id equals to this ids so that means what it will be happen if i write console dot log this dot id so let's check it what is happening here so now if i open the console so now guys here 
that means this variable is first of all i have set id uh, that value is mission by default so that's why it's coming to this one and it was opening this contact first of all. so now guys here i have set inside this id variable that is ids id means this one and in this in this ids parameter i was getting all the id so when i was clicking any tab so that's id i was getting in this parameter suppose if i click this tab this second tab so that time i will get vision so, and this inside this id that means this one so i am storing this ids that means when i will click this tab so i will get vision so that means inside this id just i am i am storing vision okay so same way if i click this value this tab so i will get this id value so that time it will be stored inside this id variable it will be stored value because in this ids i will get value when i will click this tab i hope you are getting my point what i am trying to explain so inside this console if i check here so now if i click mission so you can see i am getting mission tab mission value and that i am storing here okay so, and now if i click our vision so you can see i am getting vision id because i have passed vision here and inside this parameter i am getting vision and this value i am storing this id so that means this id value is now changed to vision the same way if i click value so that time i am getting value that is i am storing i am in this id variable okay so that's why when the value is changing here mission vision value so that time the tab is also changing here you can see the tab is changing when i'm clicking mission it's coming mission clicking vision is coming vision and value it's coming values so the tab is changing uh, according to this value okay i hope you understand whatever i'm trying to explain here and now if the tab is working so and now guys here i have to do one thing that is when i will click any tab so that time here i have to be set the yellow color so that time uh, the people will be understand that is which tab is selected okay so now guys for that here i will write a square bracket just i will bind the class so how i will bind the class so here i will write class dot and inside this css file so here you can see i have written a class that is color and inside this color uh, class i have set the color property and i have set the color so here i will bind this color here okay so the, when it, this color will be active that is when the same way the id when it will be the same like mission the same thing here i will pass and the same thing here i will copy so here i will just pass when the color will be active when the id will be same the vision just it's a condition when i will pass uh, it will be the id will be the vision so it will so active this color and when the id will be same the mission so it will active this color so it's a condition okay so you can pass the condition here like this way and you can uh, you can write anything like in jeep condition and you can active color condition wise okay so this thing so here i will pass the same thing that is when the id will be value so that time the, the color will be active so that means guys when i will click this tab so that time i will get the uh, value that is parameter and that value i'm storing in this id because here you can see in this id i'm just storing that value whatever i'm I, i'm clicking that value i'm getting by this parameter and that parameter i'm assigning here so that time in this id suppose if i click value tab so that time i will get the value in by this id and that i'm store assigning this id and when the id will be same value so that time that color will be active and the same way the the content will be this one okay i hope you have understood so now it's a done just i will save here and here you can see so by default uh, the our mission color is active it's a yellow color because guys here by default i set uh, the mission the same thing so that's why uh, here this content is by default open and this color is by default active because it's a id is same mission so when i will click this our vision so it's a change to our vision is activate and that is our vision content it's showing same the value you can see this way you can make the custom tab hope guys you have understand this uh, this condition uh, how you can write a, uh, make a custom tab and if you like this video so guys don't forget to like subscribe and press the notification bell icon to get more update